Hi guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. You know what to do, like and subscribe if you like what you see. Anyway, because of my fart situation and my, I don't think there's something right about me. I spoke to a gastro gastrologist and I'm off to the hospital now to have bloods done and a COVID test because I have a procedure on Monday. They don't think I'm lacto intolerant at all. Um, so they're not quite sure what's going on inside on a serious note. But Jesus, the smell knocks me out, it's disgusting. So it could be serious. They said it could be a health issue because normally if people break wind, this and that, I'm doing that because uh, Chris Fiondo is about to die. Um, if you're lacto intolerant, you get stomach pains, diarrhea, things like that. And I've got no stomach pains and no diarrhea. Let's go. I'm actually on time. Okay. Wow. All right, my love. Thanks. Bye. That doesn't happen. I'm never on time. Of so here I am, guys. I'm going in for my bloods, COVID test. Ready for my op on Monday. So we'll see you in a minute. Um, I just want to wait there for two tips. Hang on. You right, babe? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Hey. Thank you. Oh, I think she's in control of her feet, actually. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks a lot. There you go. Bye. Bye. Thank you. Bye. 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 See you Monday. How was it? Did they get blood all right? Yeah, they got it. I had to fill out 100 million forms. And plus, something I'm not happy about. Go on. So on Monday, yeah. I've got to take these. Is that a laxative? They said not just a laxative, it literally empty you. clears you out. <laughs> so I will be shitting all day Monday. Nice. So today is a different hospital visit. Today is about my asshole. Well, not my asshole, but my insides on a serious note. Because I, as everyone knows, I've been farting for so many years, but my farts have got worse and worse and worse. I don't get any belly ache, but I get a lot of bloatiness. And I know everyone may laugh about it because talking about farts isn't a subject that people really want to talk about, or it's funny when people fart. But mine is beyond funny now. It's it's literally like a ferret has gone up there and died. It stinks, doesn't it? Horrific. And I know we all laugh Horrific. about it. But we laugh about it, but there actually could be something wrong with me. So when I spoke to the doctor on the phone, because that's how you do your chat, he asked me all the questions and he feels the need that he needs to go, put a tube down my throat and a tube inside to see what's going on. Because he said it isn't normal to be passing so much gas like I am. And they gave me some sachets to take and literally all day I've been eating like, all day I've been pooing like a volcano erupting out my asshole. And I, st I need to go again now, but nearly I'm nearly at the hospital. So they're gonna sedate me, put a tube in the bum, in the throat, and they would tell me after what they found, literally after. So I'll be able to tell you guys after what's happened. If they found any abnormal cells, lumps, or anything like that, they would cut them away if they're in there. Or they might come to the conclusion Oh, they do do all tolerant tests to see like whether they just know if I'm tolerant or something or I might just be a smelly bastard that farts. So yeah, so I'm not looking forward to it because it's a needle and I had to have a COVID test and talking of COVID tests, I've had about three now, we've got to have a COVID test because we're going to the Maldives. Have you done a fart now? No. Are you sure? It's not my breath either. Maybe it's Sid. tube up my bottom. Just oh, had the tube down my nose. Serious. Do you want me to show you? 
No, thank you. <laughs> Why not, please? What did you say? Right, so, this is my... This is what's wrong with me. Oh, you actually have something wrong with you? Are you listening? There's a lot of things wrong with you. But it's just... Right. Well, I have to do off. this next. With them tubes. What is that? What do you do? Okay. I have to put my breath in these. FGD Hydrogen and Methane Breath Test Collection Kit. So I basically have to put my breath But I'm confused, what's wrong with you? So wait, so they collect bacteria to see if there's any bacteria that's causing upset in my stomach. Okay. So they actually haven't found anything yet. Wait. Listen, it's serious. No. I can't be I'm serious. Oh, it's not serious. You How do you know? You just can't keep it in. Yes, I can. No, you can't. Indications abdominal pain. So. Oh. Antrum. Listen, Why they went you? up my bloody rectum. Are you listening? The report. The scope was retroflexed in the stomach. The procedure was completed successfully to D2. The whole upper gastrointestinal tract was normal. There were no perioperative complications. Patient was drowsy. Assessment of discomfort was none. Resting comfortably throughout. Site 1 Antrum. Specimens. Unreads for test for H. polyal. Site second test, specimens four times biopsy. Do you know what any of that means, Mum? Yes, they what? found four things inside me no. that they've now sent off to be tested. Oh, they actually did find something? Yeah. Oh. Yeah, probably just a disgusting gas ready to go unleash out of Biopsy? I'm trying to talk about talk. my what's just my farting, so and none what? of you are listening. And it, my farting affects you all. When we watch telly, when we're generally in the house. Yeah. Yeah, but that's because you just let out. She just can't, you can't keep it in. Guys, all my friends are around, she just lifts her legs up and fart, and I'm like, it's so weird. But no lesions, proceed to colonopsy. Follow up, awaiting pathological results. That does not say pathology. What's it say? Pathology. Waiting of pathology results. Pathological. And oh, my URIS so test results, from well, that bit was negative. Oh! Is that my bum hole? <laughs> Is that an antrum? Oh, that makes me sick. Anyway. The next bit. Oh, that was gastro. I think that was going down my throat. Now this one is the colonial report. Oh, that was my throat, I think. Oh no, this was in my stomach. That actually makes me feel really sick. Is anyone listening? Here we go, this. What the hell? It Oh my god, you don't want to see that picture. What is that? What is that? That's down your throat. Yeah. That's not. Yeah, that is. That's the secret. Mum, that's down your throat, those bits. That's That's not. What is it? That looks like poo. What? That looks like mucus. It's all good. So I don't know what the farting is. It might be the diet. But they've sent some biopsies off Mom, to you see. Farted. And then I do that yeah, bacterial like test, so we will get to the bottom Why of you still the farting. Uniform? I don't know. So he said there is a reason, and he will find it. And this is what I had done today, because I can't say the words. Them two things. Which ones? You want me to read them up? Anyway, I've had it done. So the conclusion to the farting. Is that she, there's nothing wrong with her, she just can't keep it in. <laughs> No, it doesn't. So they've sent biopsies off, and then I've got to go in them tubes. So, warm in part two when the results come back in a week. And then my breath test to grow out bacterial. So, at the moment, I'm not just a dirty girl that farts. Well, at the moment, yeah. you are until we see otherwise. So, guys. Basically, I've come back from a general anaesthetic, you wouldn't even think it. But my hole's now clean as a whistle, been flushed out. I've had a tube down my throat. I've had a tube in my rectum for medical reasons. So I've been proper flushed out, that way, that way, feel clean as a whistle. And uh, no one's interested still in my fart mode. We haven't got to the bottom of it. But two biopsies, four biopsies have been sent off. So I'm either just a smelly one 
or there really is something wrong. So join me next time when I have the results. Until then, from me to you, if you like what you saw, like, like and subscribe.